He's in such a light sleep. We might wake him up. I'm going to try her out. Little Julian De La Rosa has only been in the outside world for a few days, but mom Caitlin is a veteran. He is her third. With my first, I was really nervous and just worried about a lot of things. I didn't, and I'm a lot more relaxed to this time. Caitlin is also armed with new information. Developed in Boston, doctors at Brigham and Women's Hospital use the newborn behavioral observation system. The focus was still very much on who is this little boy or girl? How can we capture his very personhood, who he really is? Kevin Nugent and his colleagues at the world-renowned Brazelton Institute developed the NBO, a tool designed to help parents understand their babies and promote a positive relationship from the very beginning. Clinicians and parents observe the new boards together to see, among other things, how babies respond to their new world. What we did today was uh, shake a rattle um, to be kind of an on-purpose interruption. Despite the noise, little Julian can protect his sleep. Research suggests that this strength-based approach can help reduce postpartum depression. In a study of 106 moms, half participated in NBO and the other half did not. One month later, the NBO moms were less depressed and more sensitive to their baby's cues. Nugent suggests every behavior parents observe is a baby's attempt to communicate. Trust yourself to learn and understand his cues. I'm Jessica Sanchez reporting.